Since 2014, India's infrastructure has undergone a remarkable transformation. These projects are more than just constructing structures. They are building the future of India, fostering economic growth and improving the quality of life for millions. Now, let's shift gears and explore how this infrastructure boom directly impacts you, the engineers of tomorrow. Whether you specialize in mechanical, civil or electrical electronics engineering, a plethora of exciting opportunity awaits for you. The rapid infrastructure development in India over the past decade has been significantly supported by advanced engineering software. These tools have not only accelerated project timelines but also solved critical engineering challenges. Let's delve deeper into how leading software is used in these projects. Hello engineers, welcome back to Engineered, the channel where we explore the dynamic world of engineering and inspire you to shape the future. I'm Surya and today we continue on our exploration of India's dynamic engineering landscape. Buckle up as we delve into a transformative journey, which is India's infrastructure development under Prime Minister Narendra Modi and its impact on engineering jobs. We will explore the exciting opportunities it presents and the skills you will need to thrive in this evolving landscape. Since 2014, India's infrastructure has undergone a remarkable transformation. Under Prime Minister Modi's leadership, ambitious projects like Bharat Mala and Sagar Mala have significantly enhanced road and port connectivity. The electrification of over 18,000 villages under the Saubhagya scheme has brought light to rural India, impacting countless lives. Additionally, initiatives like the high-speed rail corridor between Mumbai and Ahmedabad, the expansion of metro networks in major cities and the development of 100 smart cities across the nation are propelling India towards becoming a global powerhouse. These projects are more than just constructing structures. They are building the future of India, fostering economic growth and improving the quality of life for millions. Now, let's shift gears and explore how this infrastructure boom directly impacts you, the engineers of tomorrow. Whether you specialize in mechanical, civil or electrical electronics engineering, a plethora of exciting opportunity awaits for you. If you are a mechanical engineer, the focus on make in India and the drive towards renewable energy have opened doors in manufacturing, automotive and energy sectors. With new factories, and green energy projects springing up, there's a growing demand for experts in design, maintenance and optimization of machinery. Secondly, civil engineers are at the heart of this infrastructure transformation. From constructing highways and bridges to developing urban spaces and transportation systems, the need for skilled civil engineers has never been higher. Your expertise in project management, structural analysis and sustainable construction is crucial for these project successes. Third, if you are an electrical and electronics engineer, you play a pivotal role in powering these developments. The expansion of power grid, advancements in telecommunications and implementation of smart city technologies all require your skills in electrical design, automation and IoT solution. Now that we have seen the opportunities for engineers available in this market. We also want to understand the rapid infrastructure development in India over the past decade has been significantly supported by advanced engineering software. These tools have not only accelerated project timelines but also solved critical engineering challenges. Let's delve deeper into how leading software is used in these projects and the essential skill engineers need to master in this digital age. The first example I want to go with is Autodesk in urban planning and construction. Take the Delhi Metro for instance. This ambitious project aimed to reduce traffic congestion and provide a reliable public transportation system. In this project, Autodesk's suite of software played a vital role in its successes. AutoCAD provided the tools for creating detailed blueprints and technical drawings of metro station, tunnel and tracks. Softwares like Revit enabled engineers to create high fidelity 3D models of the entire metro infrastructure allowing for visualization and identification of potential issues even before construction began. Additionally, building information modeling tools 
facilitated seamless collaboration among architects, engineers and contractors by integrating all aspects of the project from design to execution into a single platform BIM ensured everyone had access to up-to-date information minimizing errors and rework. Furthermore, AutoCAD's integration with other Autodesk tools allowed for simulations of structural loads and stress tests guaranteeing the safety and durability of the metro structures. The second project that I wanted to speak about is the Smart City Initiatives which focuses on developing sustainable and efficient urban environments. Here again, Autodesk software plays a key role. Revit empowers engineers to design energy efficient buildings and infrastructure, incorporating sustainable practices and materials. BIM allows for the creation of integrated urban models that include not just buildings, but also roads, utilities and public spaces. This holistic view enables better planning and resource allocation. Smart city projects also leverage Autodesk's IoT integration capabilities. Real-time data from sensors and IoT devices can be seamlessly integrated into the urban models, aiding in efficient city operation and resource management. Now that we saw about Autodesk and its associated tools, the other software that I wanted to touch upon today is ANSYS. Let's look at ANSYS work in infrastructure simulation. Ensuring the structural integrity of bridges and buildings in earthquake prone areas is paramount. ANSYS software provides a powerful set of tools for accomplishing this critical task. For instance, ANSYS Mechanical allows engineers to perform finite element analysis. This advanced technique predicts how structures will behave under various conditions including seismic loads. Additionally, ANSYS Fluid simulates fluid dynamics enabling engineers to study the impact of environmental factors like wind and water on structural integrity. These simulation capabilities were crucial for projects like bridge construction in earthquake prone zones. By using ANSYS Mechanical, engineers could simulate the structural performance of bridges under seismic conditions. This ensured that bridges could withstand potential earthquakes safeguarding public safety. Similarly, ANSYS Fluent played a very vital role in designing high-rise buildings that can endure environmental stresses. Detailed simulations helped engineers understand how materials would react under stress, allowing them to select the most durable and safe materials for construction. The third software tool that I wanted to speak about today is Dassault Systems, especially in transportation projects. Dassault Systems software is at the forefront of transportation engineering. Take the Mumbai Ahmedabad High Speed Rail Corridor. For example, this ambitious initiative aims to significantly enhance connectivity between these two major Indian cities. Dassault's 3D experience platform played a critical role in its development. Katia, the 3D software, provided the tools for detailed 3D modeling and design of the entire rail systems, including trains, tracks, and stations. This software ensured all components fit together perfectly, minimizing errors during construction. Additionally, Simulia, another Dassault system software, enabled engineers to simulate and optimize the performance of the rail system. These simulations included stress test and dynamic load simulations, guaranteeing the safety and efficiency of high-speed rail corridor. Now that we saw about Autodesk, Dassault and ANSYS, the next software that I want to speak about is Siemens, especially in smart cities and electrification. Siemens suite of software is shaping the future of smart cities and electric vehicle infrastructure. For example, take the development of Pune as a smart city. SimCenter, a Siemens software, allows for the creation of digital twins, which are nothing but virtual replicas of a physical urban system. These digital twins enable a real-time monitoring and management of various aspects of the city, including energy use, traffic flow and waste management. This empowers city officials to make data-driven decisions and optimize resource allocation. Additionally, Siemens software facilitates the integration of different urban systems, transportation, utilities, public services into a cohesive smart city framework. This integrated approach ensures that all systems work together seamlessly, creating a more efficient and sustainable urban environment. Siemens expertise extends to electric vehicle infrastructure as well. SimCenter provides the tools for simulating and optimizing EV powertrains and charging infrastructure. 
this software helps engineer design efficient charging solutions that meet the needs of a growing EV fleet. Additionally, Siemens PAVE 360 allows for the seamless integration and validation of various EV components, ensuring the entire system operates flawlessly. The next software that I want to harp upon is GT Suit, especially in powertrain engineering. The development of hybrid and electric vehicle is crucial for a sustainable future. GT Suit software empowers engineers to optimize these next generation vehicles. This comprehensive suit provides tools for conducting multi-physics simulations, taking into account thermal, electrical and mechanical aspects of the vehicle. For example, GT Suit allows engineers to simulate the entire performance of a vehicle system, including the engine, transmission and battery. This enables engineers to optimize fuel efficiency, emissions and overall vehicle performance. Additionally, GT Power, a software within the GT Suit, facilitates detailed simulations of engines and powertrains. Engineers can use these simulations to refine and improve vehicle components and systems, ensuring optimal performance and regulatory compliance. The last but most important software that I want to focus today is MathWorks, especially in control systems and automation. MathWorks software plays a vital role in developing automated control systems for various applications, including robotics and smart builds. MATLAB provides a powerful platform for numerical computing and algorithm development. Engineers can use it to create the complex algorithm that control automated systems. Additionally, Simulink allows for modeling, simulating and analyzing dynamic systems. By using Simulink, engineers can virtually test their control systems even before deploying them in real world. This ensures the system functions as intended and meets performance specification. For example, MathWorks software could be used to develop the automated control systems for a smart grid, optimizing energy distribution and ensuring a reliable power supply. As we have all seen, India's infrastructure journey is creating a world of opportunities for engineers. Whenever you hear about the government spending money on construction and manufacturing companies, setting up development in India, start thinking about the different job roles that might become available. These developments are not just projects. These are gateways to exciting career paths. In the next episode, we will talk about the specific type of roles these infrastructure projects have created and the skills required to get recruited and excel in these roles. So keep learning, keep growing and let's engineer a brighter tomorrow. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, share and subscribe. See you in the next episode of Engineer.